Hey there, welcome to you in my YouTube channel. In this tutorial, I am going to provide ultimate Shopify SEO checklist that you need to rank your website. So, follow this Shopify SEO checklist to rank higher in organic search, bringing more potential customers to browse your online store. When it comes to driving motivate traffic to your Shopify store, no other digital marketing strategy is as affordable or impactful as SEO. For e-commerce retailers, taking the time to ensure your web pages are properly optimized can help increase your organic traffic, meaning more potential customers browsing your product. Unlike Google Ads or social media advertising, SEO strategy can drive the site traffic to your Shopify website long after your ad budget runs out. For this reason, levering SEO is one of the best digital investment a Shopify site owner can make. So what is Shopify SEO? Shopify SEO is a process of optimizing a Shopify website to perform better in search engine result. Although SEO can be applied to any website, Shopify SEO is focused on helping e-commerce retailer who utilize the Shopify CMS to earn more keyword ranking and organic traffic. Common SEO challenge for e-commerce website. In general, e-commerce websites are more likely to face certain challenges that can negatively impact search engine performance. Number one, think content. Google loves in deep long form content because product pays tend toward thin content. It can be difficult to boost your ranking in search. Number two, duplicate content with multiple product pays that are so similar or auto generated. Many e-commerce websites face duplicate content issue. Number three, four site architecture. Google like to see optimize the site structure that user can easily navigate with so many pages on their website e-commerce retailer can easily suffer from four site architecture signal number four not utilizing schema product schema help google crawl understand your product and promote them accordingly not utilizing schema is a huge mistake for shopify retailer okay so to make sure that your website does not suffer from this common setback page by e-commerce site, the Shopify SEO checklist is a great place to start. To make sure that your site does not suffer from those these common setbacks faced by the e-commerce site, the Shopify SEO checklist or this video is a great start for you. General SEO, invest in a custom domain. It's generally better to invest in a custom domains and drop the my shopify from your urls why because the url path is visible to user at the top of the sharp result custom domains look more professional and more interesting to users and higher ctrs led to better seo performance you can buy a custom domain from shopify or any third-party domain provider Choose a fast and responsive theme. With the last year's page experience update, fast page speed and load time are not negligible if you want to rank well in Google. Although flashier themes might be tempting, it is better to choose a theme that is optimized for speed and performance. Your theme also need to be far from oil on mobile device as well as Google will index the mobile version of your web pages. You can get a sense of how fast your current Shopify store is in comparison to others in your dashboard or by your page speed inside report. If your score are low, it's likely impacting in your ability to rank in the top position. Consider another more SEO friendly theme or hire developer to build a custom Shopify SEO friendly theme for you and I am also here for you. Set up your analytics tools. Your Shopify analytics dashboard will give you an overview of your e-commerce metrics 
however you need to set up additional tools to better understand your website traffic come from and how users behave once arriving at your website from search. Google Analytics and Google Search Console are must have for any site owners and they are completely free to users. After you create your account, here are some other key steps you will want to take. Submit the sitemap and add Google Analytics tagging code on your Shopify store get helpful shopify seo app there are all sort of shopify seo app that can help ensure you are meeting seo best practice across your web pages some of the favorite include plugin seo seo pro smart seo one page seo do your keyword research before you starting optimizing your content you need to identify which keyword have strong relevance to your product or will bring qualified traffic to your website there are hundreds to hundreds of way users might be searching for product like you a cure tools allow you to discover what users are searching for some of this keyword will be easier to rank than others and a part of your SEO work identifying which keyword present the best opportunities for your store the most important keyword metric to pay attention to are search volume you want to your keyword target to get a reasonable number of searches per month otherwise you are optimizing for no one cpc higher cpc represent stronger conversion potential higher cpc are most common with the commercial and transactional keyword keyword difficulty higher score will mean the keyword are more difficult to rank for make sure you choose the keyword target where you can realistically rank on page one ideally each web page in your shopify store will be targeted at different keyword or keyword cluster for your product and category space optimize for keyword that show more transactional intent as those users are more included to make a purchase for your blog post optimize for informational query to capture searcher near the top of the panel optimize your url there are some url best practice that are essential to improving your ranking in google keep it short and sweet include your target keyword avoid unnecessary word like and or the you can easily edit the url path in the search engine listing preview at the bottom of any page in the Shopify CMS. Optimize your page title and meta description. While you are editing your search engine listing, make sure you also optimize the others meta tag visible in your sharp result. You will want to follow the best practice here as well by including your keyword and remaining SEO best practice, especially length no more than 60 characters for your title tag and no more than 160 for your meta description google looks to this piece of metadata and metadata to understand what your content is about and when to be promoted and because the meta description may also be visible as a search snippet it can be influenced whether searcher click on the result google is smart enough to understand the term and praise that have a semantic relationship to your primary keyword to so there is no need to stop tap this on page element with the same keyword over and over again your meta text should read naturally and adequately describe it the content on the page use a common optimization tools for your product description think content on the product page can be a serious hindrance for e-commerce website make sure you take the time to craft original descriptive product description that include relevant keyword a content optimizer tools can help you identify which related keyword have have the most seo powered and show strong relevance signals to your product do your best do your best to include them in the natural way to elevate the ranking potential of your product page your shopify website likely had a lot of images that showcase your product but remember google cannot see your image it's important you to communicate google 
what those images are through the descriptive file name and keyword rich alter tag this also make your shopify website more accessible to users with visual impairment create blog content to target long tail query to capture user who are near to top of this sales panel create high quality big content that is optimized for relevant long tail query by answering the question user asking about product like yours you can build brand awareness and expertise it also get right to increase the total number of keyword that your shopify store rank for create an user friendly navigation menu navigation menu help your user easily move throughout your online store not only will SEO friendly navigation menu looks better to google scroll but it also create a better user experience a few SEO tips for navigation. Prioritize clear and easy navigation. Take the time to make sure that your products are well up organized into collection. Keep your navigation constantly across the page. Use the nav to help user easily contact you and your support or your support leverage internal link. Your internal link accomplish a few things that keep user moving throughout your website. The help increase search engine coral understand your site architecture and they distribute your page rank across more of your site the majority of your shopify website page rank will be on your home page which is why the link you include in your navigation menu should be strategic about sending equally to items that are out of stock seasonal or are unlikely to rank well in search result due to think or unoptimized content instead post page rank toward, toward page that you want to relevant in search like your primary category and collection pages at the product schema there are few different way to add structured data in your shopify website and which is best for you will be determined by the how comfortable you are editing your website code to add a schema manually go to theme action and edit code you can use a schema generator tools to generate your markup and input all of the required property shopify users should consider using the following product schema when at product review product review on your product can push user towards a click or purchase that can be game changing in improving ctr and generating more click to your store build link to your shopify store you will also need to build off-site signal in order for google to trust your online store and rank it in search result this is arguably the most difficult part of seo because you don't have control over whether a website chose to link to yours however there are some easy way to start earning links create high quality content like blog post and ask other site owner to link it to it get featured in the gift guide or product roundup invest in public relationship public relationship and organic outtake are at the heart of link building and one of the best way to earn high quality link from the authoritative website shopify website maintenance regularly audit your website over time your website will change this occur as you add this occurs as you add or delete pages on your website as your page accrued backlink or as the landscape of search result a regular website audit can help you determine which of your page are performing the best in search and which are unperforming the insight provided from a website where it can help you identify key content page experience or authority issue that you need to prioritize and resolve repair broken link as you change up your product offering or item of stock you will likely unpublish or delete page of your shopify website if that page was linked to anywhere else on your website you will create a broken link google does not like to rank website with a cross excessive broken link as if the website is not active and being properly taken care of once a quarter 
it's a good idea to run a site crawler across the entirety of the of your website to identify broken link and and repair them study the data and iterate as more users visit your online store your analytics tool will prepare you with load load of data about how they are behaving on your website how they got there in the first place and more make sure to draw insight from data iterate on your keyword targeting page content internal linking meta tag and more consolation remember seo has a wonderful way to lowering customer equation cost in the long term learning the basic of shopify seo and taking the necessary step can be all the difference in outranking and outperforming your competitor so thank you for your time to watch this video if you think this information is helpful then click on the like button and subscribe to my channel and if you need any service relevant shopify website design development maintenance or shopify website audit or seo then you can contact with me have a nice day bye bye